All right, Spider Island, let's do it. Yes, yes, I know, I know. Lightning point, I thought it said lightning bolt, seismic activity. This is the one where it creates a line, I think. End with less than four mech damage is not that bad. Do not kill volatile Vec, very easy, we just freeze it. Yeah, sure, let's do, um, we want to get that one, but let's do this one first. I mean, th this should be trivial because we're just going to freeze the heck out of the Vec. Although we do have to worry about blobs. Oh, God, no. Why do we got to do? Why do we got to deal with blobs? <laughs> you know, why do we got to deal with so many blobbers? Hopefully you want to attack me right here. Oh, it's a time pod. Civilians first, then the pod. Excuse me, you do not know what you're talking about. Of course you're both hitting buildings. Good. Of course you're all hitting everything. Um, let's see. Also, the push beam doesn't really work on you, does it? <laughs> it's like... Hold on. Hold on. Hold the phone. Hmm. <laughs> well, this is a this is a tricky one. I think we're gonna have to let the blobber live for a turn. Because I gotta knock you down, save you. You know we could maybe <sighs> Can we do this? Only if you go. So if we freeze you, then we can shield here. You can live for a turn. Ah, and then you're not even hitting a building, which means I can knock you into the drink. Oh, I love it, I love it. Wait, but how do I knock you down? Freeze you, that's right. I've already decided the correct response to that one. Yo, the rock man has red eyes and they're blinking. Look at that blink. Look at that blink animation. Um, so then we move over here and then we do a shield. Nope. Then we move over here and we do a freeze. Then we do a shield. He's shielded and frozen. And no building is taking damage. We'll deal with the volatile vec next turn. You're exploding, but who cares? Okay. Not bad, not bad. If we have to, we can stand still and shield the buildings again. But the blobber is gone, which saves us an action on this upcoming turn, because now we don't have to worry about the blob itself. Yeah, you, you're you fine. Actually, we don't even need to shield the building. We're just going to, like, stand still. Because you only do one damage, so I don't really care about you. But I will, because we have the turn, shield these guys. I never really thought about shielding the frozen enemies, but by doing that, if an enemy wants to hit the enemy, they gotta hit him twice. Makes sense. What are you doing? You attacking your friend? Nope, just the buildings. I can live with that. That being said, I am gonna freeze your ass. You know what? Screw you! <laughs> I've got this damn, yeah, you know, siege tank engine. I'm gonna use it. Any time, hold on, any time pods? Any time pods? Any secret time pods? Gotta make sure we look for the cracked mountains. All right, you're frozen. You, if I hit you, things are going to happen, but it doesn't really matter. I mean, honestly, that's what we want. Prepare, end turn, you'll kill your friend, give us some experience. Beautiful. Does it always split 1 XP with the top mech? I don't want her to get the experience. She doesn't need it. Loot boxes. Hey, we did get one achievement unlocked. We also got a Mercury Fist, which even if it doesn't seem like it's super usable, we can 
Um, we can just dump power into it, I suppose, which is something. Another blobber, which tells me that we do this, this, and this, and we let you blob right there. Right there, right there, right there, right there. Yep. Do enemies always, no, they don't always move their maximum turn allowance, do they? But like he moved two and his movement allowance is two. You only moved two, your allowance was four, okay. Why, would, why do you attack that? It's such a weird spot to attack. Anyways, we're gonna have to deal with this blob. Um, one shield will do it, so I don't really mind that. Uh, you, I gotta knock you onto the seismic activity tile though. That's how we do that. Then we can't solve, we can't protect the buildings. Not the buildings, no. I guess I could freeze you. That works. And we'll do this, and we'll do this. Do you think this is actually gonna make the blob live for a turn? That would be very strange. <laughs> I'd be surprised. You know, I, I, I don't have to do that. I Well, I can't kill him. I could smack you, but you're just gonna get frozen. I think I'd rather just block a spawn and end turn. Where are we? There, we're, we're good. Okay. We have a repair, I think, too, on the uh, siege mech, the range mech, so if we need to, we can just use that to heal at the end of combat. I think that'll work. Nope, you died. I wonder, I wonder what would happen if this enemy was on the tile. Because I have no idea what would happen in that situation. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh, well, you can't move as far as I need you to move. You can push, and you can freeze. So, why don't you come over here, freeze him. And then you come here. There's gonna be so many enemies. But whatever works. There may have been a better turn, actually. One, two, three, four, five. There was a better turn. I could push both of them at the same time. You know, I, I actually think that's probably worth revert, reverting. Excuse me, I muted myself that time. It just buys us an extra action. We can uh, block a spawn and then freeze you. We can block the spawn. We are going to um, be unshielded next turn, but I still like this. Because now we only have three enemies to deal with next turn instead of like four. Five actually is what it would have been. Could you stop attacking the same buildings over and over again? <laughs> well, uh, I mean, I guess I could just shield again. I do have two more uses of this, so I, I do think that's what you want to do. We'll block another spawn. Break ourselves out of the ice too, which is nice. I'm just I'm just using my mech in the back, my science mech, to just annoy the hornets so they can't do anything. And then every turn freezing one dude. I knew that was gonna happen. Did not know that was gonna happen. That's a that's a such a great turn. Unfortunately, it doesn't matter that it's great, because it still sucks. Because you suck. Okay, so we do this. 
And then we do... This. And then we do... This. And we enter. Beautiful. Didn't kill a damn thing. Man, thank God for Bethany Jones and the Cryo Launcher. <laughs> we didn't have that. Defend the Earth Mover, end battle with less than four meth da mech, not meth damage, mech damage. Oh my God, there's just so many flipping alphas. Three. Um, okay. Uh, one, two, three, four, you move there. You can get frozen there. You move in the back, you move there. I don't know how I'm gonna keep these buildings intact. Just keep pushing them around, I guess. If only the frickin' Earth Mover could actually do something. Well, you're a, fr a freeze target. You're just hitting the building? You dick. <laughs> that means I have to freeze you, so what the heck, heck am I gonna do with the rest of my turn? Oh, I hate this, because I, I don't know if we can save the building. Do that. We can shield. We can shield two of these buildings. We can shield this, freeze you, shield the building, push you, and then you hit this. I'd rather not. I could shield both of these buildings and give you a shield. Seems dumb. Probably what we're gonna have to do though. Ah, we could also freeze. Uh, freezing you doesn't matter. We would rather freeze an enemy. So freeze you. Two, four, five, three. You know, I, I actually like leaping here. Because if I do shield you, you will unshield this unit. Yeah, okay. So I like the freeze. I like the jump here. And then we. I, I like the block spawn, and I like the shield. Actually, we... We don't need to shield the buildings. Yes, we do, because you're attacking them, and you're attacking them. Ah, which means we're gonna actually lose our building, because, yeah, you're... T yeah, okay, I, you know, I, I see the problem now, I see the problem. We're gonna have to end turn, or we're gonna have to reset turn. I see the problem. It, two units are hitting this building, one unit's hitting this building, and it's the Alpha Burrower. So if I freeze the Burrower, I can move here and push you down, but then there's two units... There's four units hitting, hitting, so I don't think I can get a Wombo Combo that saves everything. Like, a leap here stops you, but then you're still hitting a building. Push beam does not go through buildings. Freezing you means you're still there. And you're there, and you're there. Freeze, what if I freeze you, and I freeze, you, freeze you, and I hit you? Freeze you, jump there, hit you, hit you, you have two HP. Well, we're gonna, we're not gonna be able to defend the Earth Mover. We're not gonna be able to do the Earth Mover because Unfortunately, there's no, there's no way, I, like, the Hornet's not going to attack the Burrower before it moves. The Burrower goes first, so there's nothing that I can do to make... No, I, wait, there is, because you go first. So you'll attack the Burrower and you'll burrow. Okay, 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 okay. So actually what we do is that we freeze you and then we push you down. That should work. Push you down. 
freeze you. The hornet attacks this burrower and then he'll burrow. Okay, okay, okay. Hit you? No, we can't do it like that. We're gonna take mech damage because I need to push you, which means we have to. Well, like, actually, if I. I can get you to disappear. I'd rather get you to die. This is a weird turn because if I. If I leap here, then push, it will actually cause this enemy to disappear, which means I could use this opportunity to freeze the scorpion? on this turn, which is actually slightly better. Or what I could do is freeze the Firefly so that I don't take the hit. That's better. So it's gonna be like this. Well, I can't do it from there. Leap, push, take one damage, disappear. Freeze the Firefly. You'll attack here, hit you, you'll attack nothing. Freeze you later. Okay, I, I I think that's the turn. We start here. We push. You disappear. I will freeze you so I don't get shot. And then you're hitting first, so you're gonna disappear. Okay. Surprisingly effective, although we are gonna have like five enemies next turn. And we did use our turn reset, which sucks. God, you again? <sighs> and I, I just have so many enemies attacking so many buildings. I'm like, okay, how the heck do we do this? Because now I definitely cannot get them to hit each other. Now we are straight gonna, gonna lose buildings. <sighs> I mean, I can just kill you. I have like different abilities that I can use here. I can... You're only hitting one building, you're hitting one building, you're hitting two buildings, you're hitting one building, you're hitting your friend. I'd rather you not free your friend. <sighs> okay, Um. let's think. What's the best freeze? Probably here. You know, there's only one building here. Maybe we'll let this building go. Freeze you. Kill you. Push you. You'll die. We'll lose one power. Freeze you. Kill you. Push you. We'll lose one power. Unless we resist it, but I don't care about resisting it. We'll take two damage and we'll have to heal that, but that's okay. At least this turn, there's only three enemies, because we finally blocked one of the spawns. Okay, you're getting frozen. Oh, there's actually two enemies, which is a little bit more surprising, in fact. No. Um. I guess I could shield here. And then you can prepare. I, I guess I could have 
Well, I mean, it doesn't matter. Block a spawn either way. Don't you dare. Don't you, uh, you're only hitting a, okay, that's perfect, okay. You're not hitting a building, you dick. <laughs> I was gonna, gonna hate life and hate you. Okay, a push and a freeze means we win. Freeze. Push. Just repair. You're hitting nothing, you're frozen, you're hitting nothing. Okay. Well, is that Perfect Island still? Did we fail the Perfect Island yet? I can't remember. There's been so many ups and downs. Is that a time pod? Did I get the time pod? <laughs> yeah, we leaped onto the time pod earlier. I remember now. I think I think we have Perfect Island. We just lost one power. Hey, Harold Schmidt. He looks so sad and old. Yep. Kill seven enemies. I, dude, I don't know if I I don't know if I can kill seven enemies. We have the Cataclysm. I guess I can push enemies into the pit pretty easily. So sure, let's kill seven enemies by pushing them all into pits. Please bomb here. <laughs> One, two, fire a bomb. And any enemy that's frozen will just eventually die on the, from the chasm anyways. I don't care. No, come on. Now you gotta make me choose. <sighs> you gotta make me choose. Well, I can uh, let you block a spawn. I could freeze you. I could protect these buildings, which means I gotta freeze the hornet? Yeah, I think we gotta freeze the hornet, shield the buildings, and I can just punch this guy. I mean, that, that makes it a really straightforward turn. Freeze. Shield. Punch. Kick, punch, it's all in the mind. Now you're not gonna be able to freeze me next turn. You might freeze this mech. A little scary. That spawn is gonna go away. You're gonna die, I don't have to move. I can actually just freeze this guy. I can do another shield too. You moved! Why did you move? Go here. Why? I can't... <laughs> I can't do anything about that! <laughs> Come on! Ugh. Not happy. <laughs> Not happy at all. Ugh. But what if I um, push the bomb? We'll get rid of it and get rid of this guy for a turn. We're not gonna. We're not gonna kill seven enemies. I've, I've, I've accepted that. Three enemies will die here. I don't know if I can get four kills between here and next turn because there's actually not even gonna be four enemies. Like there's not seven enemies on screen. One, two, three, four, five, six. Where's the seventh enemy? There isn't one. I, I, I did something that I should not have done, which was you never go for kill seven enemies on Cataclysm because there's only three turns, not four. I did the same thing in the last timeline, and I regretted it. I did the same damn thing in the last timeline. Um, and you can just end turn. I also did block the spawn, which causes the uh, like a part of the issue, but it's really the fact that you're trying to do this mission when you don't have time. You don't have time, like, the game barely has time to even summon seven enemies, let alone have you kill all seven of them. It's just not the way it's designed. Okay, freeze you. Smack you. Stand here. 
At least we didn't protect the coal plant, but we only killed three. Yeah. That's fine. We don't need the perfect island. I don't know what I need. Equipment. <laughs> they burrowed too deep to hit, likely making another hive. Look, we'll break the main hive at some point. Don't worry about it. I should do something with these reactor cores. Like, um, give you a whole bunch of stuff. Destroy the spider leader. Look, you're probably gonna get frozen. I don't have to deal with uh, the perfect island anymore. So I hate to say it, and by hate to, I mean I love to say it, probably just gonna freeze you. Because I don't wanna touch you. I don't know how I'm gonna deal with two burrowers though. We might have to freeze one of them on one turn. Two spiders, two enemies, two burrowers, two spiders, and a spider lord. Good lord. Well, I'm out of ideas. Uh, <laughs> what if we freeze you? Smack you. Can't block a spawn. And then beam you. No, we should beam here so we can block a spawn. Okay, I like it. I like it. <laughs> Jeez, forgot that it would hurt myself. Island bombing run over the burrowers. Yeah, I mean, if they just, uh, if they've burrowed too deep, whole island's compromised. Just nuke the nuke the crap out of it. D go to like one of those uh, shafts that, uh, you know, go down for miles that uh, are for oil and just drop a nuke right down it. Just go. Tick -tick. Listen to it go. Ting, 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 as it goes down. Hey, hi, ha <laughs> ha A lot more spiders, huh? Stop summoning units and spiders! <sighs> okay, we can do this, it saves the buildings. And then, can I kill you? No. All right, you know what we're gonna do? I gotta freeze you. Do we really have to? Ugh. One, two, three, four, five, six. D are we gonna have six spiders next turn? And two units, and, and a blast ion, and an alpha burrow, and a spider leader? I, I, I do not, I do not understand <laughs> what, what to do on the next turn if we, if we let that happen. That saves the buildings. We gotta, we gotta freeze you. That's like the only thing we can do. You have to get frozen. But there's not enough room to get to you. Ah. These guys, oh, you're gonna free him from the ice. Oh, well, you know, that's just what's gonna happen, I guess. <laughs> I guess you're gonna get frozen from the ice. I, yeah, I worry. I worry. Oh, don't freeze me, you piece of garbage. Yo, this squad sucks. <laughs> the random squad we got. Just realizing it now. Kind of, kind of trash. Why? Like, 
I don't like the spider boss. I'm just gonna call it. One, two, three, four, five, six spiders, two more, a scion, a burrower, a scorpion, a spider leader, and the game also has one spawn created, and it says, hey, you know what? We should probably just make another one. Like, yeah, yeah, oh, okay. More, more, huh? Okay, more, more of these pieces of garbage. Ah, uh, Jesus. There's 12 enemies. <laughs> on screen. Um Good god. Uh Well, if you leap here, you kill the blast scion. You save two buildings. I I think we'll do this. I think uh we'll finally freeze you. And, um, you know what, uh, save the buildings. Sure, there you go. Have fun. That's as good as we can get it. That's what he said. We lost one. We lost one. Now you still have a shield, I'm noticing. It's getting quite loud that that Dink, 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 dink. Twelve enemies. Twelve, just twelve. Just twelve? If it's just twelve, I can handle twelve. Um, you're hitting a building. You're hitting a building. You're hitting a building. Uh, I'd rather not have these buildings all just, like, completely die. Okay, uh, six, six. Okay, six. You got ten, you got five, you got eight, three, nine, one, not nine, nine. We're gonna lose the corporate tower, <laughs> but we can save three power. I think. No, there's there's a better play. Okay, I gotta play. I gotta move. I, I actually have a turn, believe it or not. It's this. It's this. Nope, because you're still gonna hit. What if we what if we do this? Saves it from one attack, but you're five and you're ten. You go first, you go second. Okay, I just, uh, <laughs> What if we, um, if we push down? You take a hit, you die, you uh, maybe take a hit, I don't know. Let's see what happens. You also don't move. That's unfortunate and not what I would have wanted. Yeah, let's, let's reset that turn. We can, we can do this taking only one grid power, but it is going to be the corporate building. I think we have to do it, because everything else sucks. Hold up. I guess I could let two grid power go and keep the corporate building. Sure. Ah, you know what? This is probably better because I was going to probably lose these two buildings anyways because of the order. Okay. Sure. Well, you know, we're not dead. It's not great, but we're not dead. There's going to be a lot of attacking happening. Easy. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I liked it. It took like 10 seconds for the mission to finish, too. Oh, God. Oh, beautiful. Prime weapon. Storm generator. Passive. Titan fist. Punch. Uh, Self-destruct. Beautiful. Let's buy a reactor core. I think we're going to try to get that mercury fist operational. I think we're going to put it on... The cryo launcher is something we're doing literally every turn. Ramming engines is something we can use now. The only one who would need an attack would be the defense mech, but still the push beam shield generator is something we're doing every turn. I, I don't think... I don't think we want any other power. I don't think we even want the reactor cores. I think we undo, and then we just sell, 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 and then just get the backup battery achievement. There you go. Oh, wait, we actually got two achievements there. I guess one was like a meta objective achievement. And then just like, I don't know, one more point just for the heck of it. Leave Island. 